However, the threat remains. The children of Arkham are still out there, and I will not rest until these streets are safe and firmly under my control. Well, at least he seems to be him. Good on, is that? You're so right, Joker. I mean, John. <laughs> uh, what's up with you? Hey, uh, I was wondering about. It's not lunch yet. That's not oh, what I was gonna actually, ask you. It's not time for meds either. Wasn't gonna ask you that either. Everybody's so rude. Wait, that's the move you're going to make? Oh, wait. Let's look through it first. The phone. I could unlock the gate and probably get to the phone, but I think that unlocking that is gonna cause chaos. Your key? It didn't work. <laughs> of course not. <laughs> That's not how you get out of here. <laughs> you tried it though, didn't you? <laughs> That's hilarious. Okay. <laughs> well. My enforcement squad has already seen great success. They stopped a massive attack being organized out of a local Skytrain depot. Politicians usually bore me to tears. But this one, this one has become a lot more interesting lately. In hmm. my Gotham, no one's above the law, including Bruce Wayne. After All right, Harvey, you attack know what? On Oswald Cobblepot, I had Mr. Wayne committed to Arkham Asylum. Oh, no way, it was you. The treatment he so desperately needs. Okay, Harvey. <laughs> I thought you and the mayor were friends. Okay, Harvey. I see how it is. I mean, you were supporting his campaign. He is the reason I am in here. Over I something that did I didn't even do, first Quite of all. The temper on you. I have one, too. We... In which Mayor Dent announced the creation of a special enforcement squad under his direct command to combat an imminent threat from the children of Arkham. Rest assured, we will find these terrorists, their stockpile of drugs, and their leader, this Lady Arkham, before they can strike again. Now, this is good television. Mayor on our frame page versus freaky drug terrorist. I'm gonna find your drugs. <laughs> I'm going to expose your corruption. <laughs> Lady Arkham. Is Sorry, I'm gonna cut you off, but way more dangerous than you think. Oh, I know a bit about Lady Arkham. Let me tell you. Tragically, there's still no know? sign of Gotham Gazette reporter Vicky Vale after her mysterious disappearance. Oh, I wonder why. I wonder where Very she could have gone. Tricky, Vicky. I think we both know she's quite the. Uh, Lady, right, Bruce? You're, yes, you're so right. You know that Vicky is. Tell me what you know. You want to find Vicky and her drugs, huh? Got your revenge just like you got your revenge on Cobblepot? Maybe. Publicly and dramatically, something oh, it's an option. for these newscasters <laughs> to talk about. Well, that all depends on you. If your information is good, we'll see. I knew I liked you. I've been watching you for a while now, Bruce. And I can tell there's something darker in you. When you attacked Oswald, I could tell you enjoyed it. They televised the entire attack? If those cops hadn't dragged you off of him, that Cobblepot punk would be dead. That wasn't me. It was just pump full of her drugs. Those just amplify what you're already feeling what's already inside don't be ashamed it's in your blood i see a lot of your father in you she probably does too oh dear it's obvious that's why Bruce does not want to hear that right now your dad helped bump off her parents why would my father have the veils killed i never said he killed the veils she was born in arkham victoria Arkham. What? Oh. You didn't know that? No. The Arkhams did not approve of what your dad and his partner I just thought this girl was, was nosy. They were gonna blow the whistle on the whole thing, so your dad, well, 
pop, pop. Her parents murdered, leaving her with an unquenchable thirst for vengeance. God, gotcha. surely you can relate. Tragedy hmm. can drive people to do some pretty dark stuff. Don't try to make this about me. Of course, it's about you, Bruce. This is all about you. I mean, you and Vicky are both dark souls, hmm. and now you're heading on a collision course towards each other. That's gonna be fantastic. You see, I know what you really are, and that's why I really want to tell you where Vicky's moved her drugs, but. You're not gonna do anything while you're stuck in here. So, I vote we get you out. How hard can it be? You're Bruce Wayne. The Waynes always get what they want. All it would take is a phone call. <laughs> I just want my phone sure, call. Sure, but there's no phone. <laughs> right. uh, assume I can take care of that. Oh, now y'all did but not all need to turn around before. <laughs> When I get out of here, you're gonna owe me a favor, okay? Just um. one. Yeah, I don't know what it is yet. But what's one favor between friends? Okay. Sure, one favor that seems fair. Okay. Excellent. We'll have oh dear. loads of fun. You'll see. Oh no. I tell you what, I'm gonna make a distraction to get the guards away from that gate. The rest is up to you. You make that phone call, and I promise I'll tell you how to find those missing drugs. Hey, Zaz. Hello, this is... Zaz. What the hell this did you This is bad. <laughs> a bit. What happens if you make a tally mark before? You kill someone. What are you talking about? Oh, he about to lose it. No. John. No, 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 I don't match him. Oh, God, I don't match. You can fix that right now. This game feels like it's itching. Burning. Need to, um, need to get rid of it. Okay. Stop. Someone give me a sedative. All right, I'm going to make a break for it. Run! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, use the phone. <laughs> oh. Uh. Use Gordon connection. Use lawyers. Oh. Lawyers. Hello? Alfred. It's you, sir. It's so good to hear Gordon might voice. be mad at me right now. He didn't even really you, care for me too much. Me they told me you'd lost your mind. Contact my lawyers. You'll need to post bail, but that shouldn't be a problem. You have got it's to get him in the background cackling. I'll see what I can do. <laughs> I have to go. <laughs> Oh, Bruce, I have not had this much fun in ages. Let me tell you how to find Vicky's stash of missing drugs. Do tell. Ask the Veils. The Veils? What? Quickly, come on. In her family, like, gone? Good luck on the outside, Bruce. I just know you're gonna put on quite a show. <laughs> Pretty grisly scene in there. Multiple stabbings. One of the orderlies had a finger bitten off. If you're looking for who to blame, maybe start with the mirror because you're the one that left violent psychotics unattended. Mr. Wayne, I understand you have been through a trying day, but that does not give you the freedom to criticize me or this facility in that way. I'm in the facility. Because from my perspective, my patients were fine until you went into that rec room today. Well, yeah. 
One moment. Potato, tomato, whatever. <laughs> Seems you have a visitor. Alfred, get me out of here. Immediately. Alfred. Ah, oh, Bruce. Thank heavens you're all right. You see, everything is in order. He is to be released into my care. You may have the money to make this go away, but this is going to hurt you in the long run. Were you what going to help me? In your room? The riot with Zaz? You clearly need help, Bruce. He needs extensive evaluation, treatment. I think I'll get a second opinion. Yeah. I'm sure you can afford the one you like. Hmm. Let's go, Alfred. Bye. I will see you on the outside, Bruce. I can't wait. <laughs> What's that about? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> what have I done? Okay, guys, we're going to stop it there today. Sorry, sometimes it goes blurry. I'm not sure like what is going on with that. And also in the settings, I can't do anything to change it. Um, and even when I reload the episode, it still does it. So yeah, sorry about that. But if you like this video, um, please leave a like and also comment below. Let me know your thoughts or just say hi and subscribe if you want to. See you guys in the next one. Bye.